Easy Migration software has been designed to help you easily copy the contents of your hard drive to another drive. This tutorial will show you how Easy Migration works and how quickly and easily you will be able to migrate to a larger hard drive. When we open Easy Migration, the main menu appears and offers us two choices. We can copy a drive or we can choose to manage a partition. Let's click on the Copy Drive icon to start copying our data. In the My Computer window, Easy Migration displays all the drives that are connected to our computer. As you can see, we have two drives. The smaller drive is the C drive. It is our internal drive and contains our data. This is the drive we want to copy. We call it our source drive. Our other drive is called the E drive. This is the larger drive. This is the drive we want to copy to. We call it our target drive. Before we can begin the copy process, we must designate which drive is the source drive and which is the target drive. Since C is our source drive, we will drag the C drive icon into the source drive box. Now we'll drag the E drive icon into the target drive box and click Next. A message will appear asking if we want to continue. The copy process will overwrite all the existing data on the target drive. If there are any files on the target drive that we might need, we could stop now and transfer these to another media before the drive is overwritten. To begin the copy, we click Yes. Easy Migration will begin to copy the drive. Your copy time will depend on the size of your drives. When the copy has been completed, Easy Migration will ask if we would like to use the Partition Manager tool. We could exit now by clicking No, but we need to expand our partition to be able to gain full access to the space on the new drive. We click Yes. The Partition Manager displays all the drives connected to our computer and the arrangement of the partitions on these drives. As you can see, our target drive has 205 gigabytes of unused space. In order to make the space available, we must expand the active partition. There is a small partition blocking our access to the unallocated space. It will be necessary to move this small partition out of the way. When we hover our mouse over the partition, the mouse becomes a cross shape. This means that the partition can be moved. We drag the partition to the far right of the drive. Now we click Next to continue. Let's click Yes to accept the move. Easy Migration begins to move the partition. Your move time will depend on the size of your partition and data on the drive. When the move has been completed, we click OK. Now the active partition and the unallocated spaces are touching one another and we are ready to begin expansion. We right click on the active partition and select Expand. The slider bar appears. We want to expand our active partition so that it occupies all of the remaining space. We click on the slider and drag it to the very end. Click Next. Let's click Yes to accept the expansion we selected. Your expansion time will depend on the size of your partition. When the expansion is completed, we click OK. We are returned to the Partition Manager tool. This window shows how our target drive looks after the expansion. You can see that the target drive no longer has any unused disk space. We have migrated successfully the contents of our source drive and expanded our partition to the new hard drive. The new hard drive is now ready to be installed in our computer. This ends the tutorial. Download your copy of Easy Migration Software and start transferring your data to your new and larger hard drive.